Hi everyone, it's Emmanuel here. For those of you who love Jesus, I have a very exciting question to ask you, and that is this. If you can be a part of something that will literally touch millions of souls for the gospel of the kingdom of Jesus Christ, do you want to be part of it? Okay, and you have a chance to be part of this, um, uh, and that's what I want to talk to you about in this video. In, in my hands right here are two piles of things, and I have a lot more of these in my own room. One pile of it are posters, which are, will be inserted in the second pile, which are envelopes. And what these are essentially are um, a, a front and back side posters, which I designed personally. And I'm going to put a link uh, in the bottom of this video where you can download and you can freely distribute it. And it just basically warns people about the coming of our Lord Jesus Christ. Okay. Um, it talks about, is your church rapture ready? And on the back, it talks about, are you ready to meet God and, and stand before His judgment? And we talk about the different signs about the coming California earthquake, the war with Iran, the tsunamis coming in the east and west coast, um, New York, New Jersey, Boston area, these pl places will be, will be uh, flooded. And we talk about how many believers will be left behind because we talk about scripts like Matthew 25, Hebrews 12, 14, James 4, 1 John 2, Luke 21. We, we fill with scriptures and basically telling people, guys, Jesus says we are to watch for His coming. We are to watch and pray that we're kind of worthy, okay? And, and He's coming back for a blameless and spotless bride. And the unfortunate thing uh, is that uh, there are so many churches today, if, if not the perhaps even the majority of the churches today, are not preparing the people for the coming of Jesus. Um, they're preaching on many other things that uh, perhaps, like honestly, has, has really has no bearing in, in the signs of the times that we're in right now. And uh, instead of us just really kind of complaining and, and, and doing nothing about it, why don't you and I do something about this? And that's what this video is all about. Let's go out and send this, mail this, share this, distribute it, email it in any way that we can to our friends, family, and loved ones, and I even have a better proposal, and that's what I'm doing, okay? I personally printed 2,500 of these, okay? Initially, I was gonna do it on, on my own printer, but later on, I, uh, through a, a brother in Christ, I was able to print these in color cheaper uh, than I could print it with black and white in, in staples. It's a blessing from God. So, but anyway, you can print these out, download these, and print it off your printer, or you can simply uh, send the file through your email to your friends, loved ones. But uh, aside from doing that, I, I want to do this campaign that I hope can reach worldwide internationally, because I know, uh, um, uh, praise God, that some uh, many of my videos are watched internationally by many people. And I'm thinking if we can do this all over the world, this can have a, a worldwide effect. And what I've done on my, uh, on my own is that I went to Yellow Pages in Canada and I gathered up, uh, and actually I'm still in the midst of doing this, I'm gathering up 2,500, 2,500 church addresses. I'm going to their websites, going on Google, looking up the, the, the churches that has a website, then clicking on um, the pastor's name. So what I do is I, I, I on the label, I, I'm obviously mailing these out, okay? I'm putting first the pastor's name, uh, I, I do, uh, I have the title, Re-Urgent Announcement. Then I do the pastor's name, I do the church name, and the church address. And I'm mailing 2,500 across Canada, these posters across Canada. And then uh, at the bottom, I have a, a website and an email, um, which people, if they want to contact us, uh, they can contact us, you know, but it's not about promoting someone's website or whatever. I'm telling you, if you have a website talking about people, talking about the coming of Jesus, preparing people in holiness and righteousness, you put your thing there. You put your website, you put your email, you, you follow up with these people. This is not about promoting anyone, but to get the message out and to warn the church of Jesus Christ that we absolutely need to be awake at this hour. And I'm just thinking in my head, right, I was doing the math, okay, uh, when I was do before I was doing this video. Now, let's just say, now, the many videos that I get, uh, some over a few thousand, a few thousand views. Let's just say if 1,000 people, after watching this video, uh, let's just say 1,000 people take up this call and send this out, okay, prints it and mails it out to your local churches. I'm just thinking, let's just say 100, okay. Each 1,000 people watching this video may each mail out 100 of these posters to the local churches. That uh, would bring us 100,000 uh, 100, of these posters mailed out to the churches. Now, let's just say 10% of these posters are read and, uh, by these pastors and they actually talk about it to their congregation. Okay, uh, only 10%, that would be 10,000 of churches are talking about this. 
Okay, now I'm doing a conservative thing. If we can get this thing viral, if we can get this thing multiplied, it'll be awesome, okay? But let's just say 10,000 churches are, are doing this, and e let's say each church have 200 people. Some have more, some have less, okay? Let's just say 200 times 10,000, that's 2 million people hearing about the coming of the Lord Jesus Christ, preparing themselves in repentance, seeking God, pursuing holiness, living a holy life before God, we can reach 2 million souls. Now, I'm, I'm thinking, this is just like, I'm just going off the numbers of 1,000 people doing this uh, 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 with 100 posters. I mean, if some of you will just do, I mean, maybe 200, 300, 500 or more, you know, we can get this thing viral. We can get this thing to the ends of, to the, ends of the, world, to the world. This is what I'm hoping. Now, I'm telling you there are many other people doing this already. Many people posting posters or, or links or posts on, on Facebook and stuff like that. You know, praise God. Praise God. Hallelujah. Let, let's just keep doing this, guys, because not a lot of people are, are awakened to the fact that Jesus is coming soon. And, you know, people are watching, you know, people are spending time on, on looking on the next, you know, star coming out on, on, on NBA and, you know, like the, the Grammy Award, the Super Bowl and all these things. Man, we are so late in the hour that I am absolutely not surprised if Jesus comes anytime in this year. In 2012, I will absolutely not be surprised. I'm looking forward to it. Now, am I saying absolutely he's going to come? I don't know. It could be, you know, another year, another few years, or even, you know, if he comes in the next, if he comes after 20 years, it doesn't matter to me. I'll be doing the same thing, warning people about the coming of Jesus. But I honestly, honestly believe, having studied the signs of the times since 2009, God has awakened me to the fact that he's coming very soon, and he awakened me to the fact that I was living in sin, calling myself a Christian. You can look at my testimonies on my, on my other videos. But since 2009, you know, following the signs of the times, studying biblical prophecies, I'm telling you, I, if I have to tell you all the things that God has shown me and to tell you all the dots that I've connected throughout the years, I can sit here with you probably for the next two, three days showing you how late the hour is that we're in, how Jesus can come anytime, really literally, because people just hear it as like a slogan. But I'm telling you guys, let's do something about this. So what I propose is this. Okay, for those of you watching this video, please don't just close it and, and, and don't do anything about this. At the very least, click on the links below, okay, uh, in, in the description below in this video. Uh, perhaps I can even put a link on this video. Go and download these two posters and email it to your friends, to your family, and to your churches, and to your brothers and sisters in Christ. We absolutely need to do this. After you email it, post it on your Facebook, post it on MySpace, whatever social network that you use, post it there, okay? And, and lastly, I think that's the most important thing is each person, let's just try to send out 100 of these posters to our local churches around your city, around your you know, place. I'm just going on yellow pages. I'm going on different towns, different provinces. I'm sending across Canada. Okay, I'm doing it, you know, it, it, you know, like it, it costs, you know, yeah, I mean, it costs some money to print, the postage and all that stuff. But to be honest, if you're only doing a hundred of these, okay, if you're only doing a hundred, that may be just like one night out of dinner with your family. Really? Now, if you can sacrifice one night out of dinner with your family and, and to do something for a guy, come on guys, we, we can absolutely do this, okay? And I hope that you, you join me because I am only one person. And, but if we can get, if we can, if we can get just 1,000 people do this, and hopefully a few thousand more. I mean, another thing is post this video, make it viral, get many people to do this together, okay? So that more people can hear of this message. Now you can go download this poster, which is warning people about how, how late the hour is. Please go and do this. And, but the most important thing, number one, guys, is make sure you and I, that our lives are ready for the coming of Jesus. Because the, the, the worst thing is that we go and warn other people and we ourselves are left behind and we miss the kingdom of God. Okay, now uh, on, on this poster, you know, it's, it's dated January 26 because that's when I actually did it. But um, uh, throughout this time, you know, I, I was actually mailing it out, um, doing different addresses and I had different things I had to take care of. But let's just get this out now, guys, because uh, the, the, the end is here. Jesus is coming soon and those who are ready will go with him. And soon he's going to come back. God, Jesus is going to set up some millennium kingdom. And this is really no jokes. Okay, this is exciting stuff. Let's reach millions and millions of souls for Jesus. Let's go send this out to as many people as possible. Email it, Facebook it, MySpace it, whatever you use, do it. 
okay? So that we can get the word out. And by the way, if you don't want to use this poster, it's, it's okay. Use your own poster. Make your own. You know, put your own address, put your own emails and all this stuff. Just get the message out. The, the, the whole thing, the whole intention about this thing is to warn people about the coming of Jesus. That's it. And may we first seek first the kingdom of God and His righteousness on our own and repent daily before God, live a holy life before Him. And after we do that, let us warn other people about the coming of Jesus. And I pray in the name of Jesus. Let's just pray right now. For those of us who are actually going to take upon this campaign and do this, let us pray, okay, that these posters, whatever we send out, okay, will be used by God and, and people will be awakened to the fact church, whole churches will see. Okay, let's just pray right now. Father God, in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, your holy son, we pray right now, God, we thank you that you reveal to us through your word that you're coming soon through your biblical prophecies and through knowing the signs of the times. God, we know that you can come at any moment now. And we pray, Father God, for these posters, for these flyers that we're going to send out. God, we pray for every single person who we're going to email it, you're going to Facebook it, and MySpace it, and mail it to the churches. We pray in the name of Jesus, the Holy Spirit, that you will convict the hearts of people who will look at these posters that will not, they will not trash it, they will not throw it away, but they will open it. And the moment they see it, God, I pray that you convict their hearts and bring them on their knees in repentance and humility before you, Lord God, that they will hear the message of repentance and the holiness, that they'll prepare themselves for your coming. Father, we pray, we pray in the name of Jesus, God, that your people will prepare themselves to walk in blameless and spotless ways, which is what Jesus is going to come back for, a spotless and, and blameless church. Through your blood, Jesus, wash us clean, Lord God. I pray that you help us walk in a path of righteousness. In the name of Jesus, we declare the anointing of God on these, on these posters and every single one that's going to be sent out by the people that are watching this video. In the name of Jesus, we declare that lives will be changed, that whole churches will be turned around in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth and we rebuke every demonic spirit that try to come against the project, every demonic spirit that try to come against the people, they're trying to do something for God, we rebind them in the name of Jesus and we plead the blood of Jesus over the church of Jesus Christ and over the people that are watching this video. In the name of Jesus, let this campaign, let, let many ministers around the world, Lord God, we pray for all those. In the name of Jesus right now, we pray for those who have the heart of God, those who are true shepherds in the name of Jesus. Around the world, Lord God, I pray that their voices will be heard, that the true gospel will be preached and will be embraced by those who are hearing it in the name of Jesus. Let signs and wonders and miracles be brought forth and healings and deliverance be brought forth. At the preaching of these true ministers of God, Lord Jesus Christ, may your name be glorified. May people repent of their sins, trust in you, and by your Holy Spirit, Lord God, let this be done. Let conviction be brought up upon their heart. In the name of Jesus, Father, let your righteousness dwell on the earth. And we pray that you come, Lord Jesus. Come, Lord Jesus, and we pray. Let the Spirit and the Bride say come. In the name of Jesus Christ, we pray. Your righteousness and your will be done on earth as it is in heaven. In the name of Jesus Christ we pray, amen, so be it. Guys, this is going to be exciting. Let's reach millions and millions and millions of souls for the gospel of Jesus Christ. So make your own videos, make your own posts, make your own posters. If not, use these ones. And let's get the word out because the time is at hand. May we prepare ourselves and prepare others for the coming of Jesus because when He comes back, Jesus says, surely, I'm coming quickly, and my reward is with me to give to each one according to his works. Amen. <laughs> Let us work and do the will of God until he comes, because surely Jesus is coming quickly. God bless you and your household. May you continue to remain on a narrow path that leads to life until Jesus comes back. God bless you. When he comes